Now, now, BlizzCon. <laughs> Hearken to me. War Chief. <laughs> Always wanted to say that. Hearken to me. <laughs> Thank you. Whether you are a current player, and I'm going to bet that most of you are, <laughs> or maybe you jumped off the wild train a few expansions ago, now is the time to come home. <laughs> I hope so. That we really need a lot more players, now especially role players. Please come into the game. To pull on your boots, Arjun Dawn. Pick up your broadsword or your favorite glowy staff and get in this fight. <laughs> Friends, Azeroth needs her defenders now more than ever. Now. In a few moments, we are going to give you a deeper look at the war within. But before we do that, I want to leave you with a little something to chew on. I want to remind you all that sometimes very epic things can begin with small, heartfelt moments. What you're about to see yeah. is one of those moments. Okay. This is the trailer. BlizzCon. Proud defenders of Azeroth. Let the World Soul Saga begin. Oh, maybe it is the trailer. Yep. Oh, is that Anduin? That's the sword. I suppose he's been through hell, literally. Which is why he hasn't been at Stormwind for such a long time. He's just trying to get to grips with everything that's happened, with everything that Sylvanas put him through. God, he's fairly changed. I suppose that'll do that to you. Oh God, he has really changed. He's seen some shit. Being locked in, basically being locked in. Sorry for pausing it, but basically being locked in, you know, him, himself really. Um, he could see everything that was happening, but couldn't do anything about it. So, yeah, I mean, you have to come to grips and come to terms with that. I suppose he probably feels the lights abandoned him, but he needs to. Oh. Thrall? Oh. You're here to tell me we don't get to hide. Yeah, well. Is that it? Barak. You know. Barak said that. We stayed away. But time by itself heals nothing. You didn't just come here for me. It's the visions. You've seen them. I suspect many have lately. Something. Someone is calling out from the heart of the world. Like a voice from a dream. <laughs> Something dark is coming, Anduin. The world needs your light again. My son. I'm not that person anymore. I have no light. Not after what I've seen. Not after what I've done. Hmm. 
you are not your past, Anduin. I trust you. Hmm. Need our king back. Both here in this. It's a pity we didn't have Varak still. Look, whatever's coming, I'll stand with you. Of course, I will. But we were drawn here by the voice. Who is it, Thrall? Who's calling out to us? I'm not sure yet. But they suspect the Titans? Or someone linked with them? But that sword... was aimed at someone. Them. I think this should be good. Hopefully, we'll be able to stream this live if we get it a few days before launch. I guess we're not ignoring that sword anymore. <laughs> I do have to say, though, uh, every time I see that cinematic, and I've seen it many times, it gets me right in my heart. Uh, it feels like a new beginning and it feels like coming home. And we are so excited about where we are going. And now that you've seen or heard the overview for the World So Saga, let's talk about the war within. As we all gather and explore beneath the surface, we'll find an ancient Nerubian civilization. They will be led by someone we were first introduced to in Legion, Zalatath. A harbinger right. of the void. <clears throat> the void brings destruction and darkness that threatens all light in our world. The last time we saw Zalatath, she promised we would meet again. And it turns out she was right. And while Anduin, Thrall, and others share the same visions emanating from the heart of the world, some are seeing something quite different. My visions are not the same as the others. No radiance, no song, just the shadow taunting me mm. from below. Okay. There's a lot more new raids and dungeons based on this as well. This should be interesting. The Ringing Deeps. Hollow Fall, okay. Looks cool. Delves. Or your Warpand. Earth and Alliance, new race of dwarves. So that leak was true then. Although it doesn't look that Alvaloran leak was true. The fate of our world rests upon the edge of a knife. And our battle lies deep within. Hmm. Cool. 